going on, my fellow A-plusers? It's your more phenomenal host, Adam Perez, back once again. Thank you very much for certainly joining us here today, as I've got a brand new video for you guys today, as we have some news that we're going to go ahead and break down. Uh, last weekend, guys, we talked highly about the idea of Dino Fury moving over to Netflix. Not only is the first half of season one going to go ahead and drop this June, but we also have season two of Dino Fury going to Netflix as well, per Chance Perez himself. Uh, and as far as the future of Power Rangers after that, very much in limbo, very much unknown right now as uh, they are working behind the scenes to develop brand new series for us. So today, guys, we do have our, some uh, new information that wind up drop uh, dropping on Monday afternoon for you guys over on Twitter uh, as one of the CEOs opened up a little bit more in regards to Power Rangers certainly going forward. So let's go ahead and highlight that real quick because that actually comes to us from PerRanger.com. Uh, go ahead and check them out at, at Power Rangers. You can go ahead and check it out right there on the screen if you like. But it says Hasbro and EO, uh, E1 uh, participated in the JP Morgan 49th Annual Global Technology, Media, and Communications Conference. So they had a conference this week. It says E1 CEO Darren Thropp uh, had the following to say about Power Rangers, saying Power Rangers is being worked on now with a creative steward uh, and a big streaming partner. We haven't brought that to an announcement stage as of yet. So the fact that they haven't made official announcement certainly makes me think that they're certainly working on behind the scenes, whether that be developing the series itself, maybe uh, crossing out the T's and dotting the I's uh, in regards to some legal paperwork or for, you know, for these agreements and things like that for the streaming service that they're going to. Uh, but look, it's not super detailed, uh, but they are at least continuing to work on Power Rangers. A couple things I definitely wanted to go ahead and bring up. The fact that it does mention that uh, it's coming to a big streaming partner. Uh, again, we talked a little bit about the idea that maybe perhaps it's Netflix. Maybe the idea of Dino Fury being very active over on Netflix means that Hasbro behind the scenes is working with a deal with Netflix in order to continue Power Rangers in some form, whether that be the kids show, whether that be animated or uh, this new iteration of Power Rangers that we're going to be getting that's a little bit more adult themed. So we'll definitely see. But a big streaming service. They haven't named Netflix. Netflix is just a name I'm throwing out there based off of the partnership that they currently have with Netflix. Uh, but who knows? It could certainly be Amazon. It could certainly be Paramount+. Plus. The fact that they're saying it's a big streaming service makes me think that perhaps it's part of like the big three. Maybe like a Hulu, maybe a, a Amazon, or maybe a Netflix. If I had to guess, though, I'm certainly leaning the Netflix route here. Um, but it does say that Power Rangers is being worked on now with the creative steward, which to me sounds like somebody that's crafting and building this world. I do find it interesting that they did not mention Jonathan Entwistle's name in here. Um, I feel like in the past, they certainly haven't shied away from dropping Jonathan's name. So I'm wondering if anything has changed or if this is just how uh, Darren wanted to go ahead and, um, and present the information. Again, short and sweet and to the point, right? Power Rangers is being worked on now with a creative steward and a big streaming service. So I automatically am going to Jonathan Entwistle and Netflix. But who certainly knows? Again, the fact that they haven't mentioned this steward in this comment, uh, I don't know if that's uh, if that's digging a little bit too deep or I'm picking for something, but we'll see if it still continues to be Jonathan and Whistle at the end of the day. But I do want to ask you guys a question. Who do you think the big streaming service uh, partner certainly is? Do you think it is, in fact, Netflix with all the Dino Fury announcements we've had about going over to Netflix? Or do you think they might actually dabble in another streaming service uh, at this point in time for their upcoming new Power Ranger uh, stuff? So I definitely would love to know what you guys think in regards to that. So we'll definitely see what happens here, guys. If anything, uh, maybe some new information will drop as the weekend progresses. If not, we definitely will go ahead and further talk about it this Saturday. That's right, live every Saturday at noon central time for our live episode of A Plus More Phenomenal. So definitely go ahead and join us then. Uh, so the fact that we have an announcement that's not ready to be made but coming soon, I definitely do think we're going to get something really big in regards to some announcements this summer before Dino Fury winds up returning. So let's keep our fingers crossed, guys. The excitement continues to build. What do you think about this? statement. Are you worried? Are you happy? Does it sound like things are going pretty smoothly behind the scenes? Definitely go ahead and let me know your guys' thoughts in the live chat or the comment section box below. But until next time, guys, do me a big favor. Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. And as always, keep it A+. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.